part participating in the procession at St. John the Divine, Blessing of the Animals. Well, it's in remembrance of St. Francis of Assisi. October 4th is the, the day that commemorates uh, that saint and to honor him the the Episcopal churches around the city they do the blessings of the animals well we have Oscar the tortoise he's an African horned land tortoise well he needs to get blessed today just symbolizes the same things that we all look for from a blessing long life happiness prosperity spirituality and animals deserve that too. <laughs> the event itself is a celebration of, of creation, it's a celebration of God's love. It's all built around uh, our, our regular Sunday worship, which is which is such a thanksgiving. This is of course a very elaborate and it, and it uh, highlights the life of St. Francis as one who, who made these issues very much prominent in his own life. It's an, a wonderful event because it celebrates life, it celebrates God's uh, creation and our place in it. It also is a reminder, as the sermon pointed out today, that we are not doing our part in that in that uh, in that responsibility. So it's it's both a reminder of what we need to do and also a celebration of what we have. It's like you're blessing. It's sort of like you're blessing the world. You know, you're blessing the world with this whole um, like the whole show, and then you're blessing the animals. It's just giving your love, showing your showing your love to everything. I guess the symbolism is that you know all animals really matter to people and that they have a special place in our life um, and that they should be blessed they should you know they're part of the family lots of times and they do a lot for us even though we may not think about it we shouldn't just celebrate animals once a year I think we should celebrate them every day